Dude, we are killing it. I mean, killing, killing, killing it. You would be amazed at how much we put to debt again this month. Hi, I'm Wendy Valencia. My husband Mauricio and I are currently on the Dave Ramsey baby steps, baby step two to be exact, and we are working our way through more than $300,000 worth of debt as quickly as we can. We are here to motivate you in your debt payoff process, sharing everything we learn along the way. So if that interests you, go ahead and click that big old red subscribe button down below. I am not even kidding you when I tell you that we did fantastically this month and we hit personal milestones, something that is very significant to us. So today I am going to walk you through what we paid off in debt this month. I will give you the exact numbers we have paid off and which accounts it went to. And I'll be using graphics from Undead It to show you exactly what we've been doing. So going into this month, we still owed $183,075 with an estimated debt payoff date of September of 2020, which feels like forever away, but it has been two years on this plan. And that feels kind of like yesterday that we started it. The first payment we made this month was to Mauricio's school loan. And that amount is $184.56. And the current balance on that is $50,534. You'll notice if you compare our current balance and the highest balance that we are making zero headway. I was asked by numerous people how we got that payment to be so low. And what I did is I selected the lowest possible payment I could find for right now, knowing that we are gonna pay it off in just a couple of years. So we just wanted to pay the absolute minimum we could, but really we are making no headway on our debt. It's basically interest only payments. So, you know, I wouldn't recommend it for a long-term plan, but on this plan, it's gonna work. The next debt we made a payment to was our personal loan. And we put $200 to that loan this month. And the current balance on that loan is $24,647.07. The next loan that we made a payment to was our USAA loan. And that payment was $1,186.60. The current balance on that loan is $52,112. Then we paid our car loan and we paid $465 to that loan. And the balance on that loan is $14,255. The next loan that we paid was our Navy Federal Visa and we put $260 to that. And the current balance on that is $9,676. So this one is finally below $10,000, which is amazing, but not as amazing as our snowball payment. So based on all those payments, we went from having a payoff of September 2020 down to August 2020 with a balance of $179,329. And then we made our snowball payment. So this is where we were at the end of March. Our Navy Federal Credit Union loan was sitting at $28,106. It was due to be paid off in November of 2018, which is later than our original payoff date. And this is our balance as of today, $19,856. With a debt payoff of October 2018. Yep, that's right. We paid $8,250 to our snowball loan. Yeah, it's awesome. The big milestone was getting this loan under $20,000. For whatever reason, the difference between $30,000 and $20,000 mathematically is, is just the difference between twenty dollars and $30,000. But in our heads, it's the difference between 
it's really huge and oh my gosh, this is actually possible. So getting it under $20,000 is amazing. Oh my goodness. So what is our new balance and our new debt-free date? Our new debt-free date is July of 2020 and the balance is $171,079. Yep, we dropped two full months off of this with this one payment, two months. And this month we put $10,546.60 16 cents to debt. Whoa, that's a lot of money. Two months in a row. So I bet you're wondering how we did it considering our normal goal is to put between $6,000 and $7,000 to debt. Well, remember I mentioned we'd be getting a tax refund for 2017? It came in. Yay, we had a huge payment again to debt this month, but I wanted to show you how that is going to impact our snowball for the rest of the year. Now, I know I said we are moving out in October or November of this year, but check this out. If we stay for an additional three months, we will actually have paid off three debts. The Navy Federal Loan, the visa, and our car loan. That's very tempting. And we're actually anticipating having our first loan paid off in August, which would mean two months later in October, we'd be paying off the visa. And in November, we would be paying off the car loan. Really, really tempting to stay. And then it's like another four months and we'll have the personal loan paid off. Ugh. It's not really until the end of our snowball does that time start getting long. <laughs> really, I think the longest interval between payoffs was the, the interval between the second payoff and the third. But that is 100% because we moved our biggest loan up to the front. So we would be able to move out and have enough money to live on without overstressing ourselves. The... Other thing I wanted you to notice about this chart is if you look at May 2018 for the Navy Federal Loan and the Navy Federal Visa, there are two dashes. And I will tell you, this is one of those things that irritates me about undebted. It's a, it can be clunky at times, I will tell you. So for whatever reason, when you make an, a big payment, it assumes that you're not going to make the following month's payment. And so that drives me crazy. But we are, in fact, going to put at least $4,703.84 to debt to our snowball in May. So it's going to shift that debt from October 2018 payoff to September 2018 payoff. But again, we're anticipating having it paid off in August of 2018. Si Dios quiere. That's Spanish for God willing, essentially, if, if God wants. And God willing, we will be making another fantastic payment next month. Remember, I know what we're paying next month because what we earn in one month goes to pay next month's bill. So I already know what our debt payment will probably be next month. And it's way more than I thought it was going to be. I got some pretty awesome surprises coming up in May. So if you want to follow us through the rest of our journey in 2018, the year that we are kicking debt to the curb, make sure you click that big old red subscribe button. Oh, I can't believe how much we paid off in two months. That's like $25,000 in two months that we paid off almost. That's a lot of money. Things are going awesomely at the Valencia household lately. So, I'll see you in the next one. See ya!